any of their YouTube squint here. Um, so it's been a little bit since uh, I put any videos out. I just wanted to uh, let you guys know uh, my, my father passed away on Friday so today I'm just going to do a uh, quick review on a product that I got in the mail um, and uh, put this video up and then I probably won't be I probably won't be back for a little bit so uh, I gotta do all the funeral services and everything so um, I'll be out this week alright um, I got in the mail today um, oh, uh, the Praxis kit came in this little camouflage case nice zipper case um, it's not the it's not the first handleless, you know, pick set that I have. I have the uh, Mad Bob's pick set also. Um, can't really use it too much. The reason I got this was uh, really the reason I got it was because of the fifteen thousandths, uh, fifteen thousandth size picks. I needed some thinner picks. Um, I don't really care too much for the rakes. I'll go ahead and pull all this out. A couple of tension wrenches. All oh, those are 15 thousandths. So this kit comes in 15 thousandths and 23 thousandths. You can see the case. Nice rig. It's got a hard back. Um, looks like it'll be okay for some type of everyday carry. Um, you can see the size difference between my Sparrow's case. About the same size. It just doesn't have the the double the double thickness. Uh, so, but you know, for what it is, it's not a bad case. <coughs> um, as you can see, the picks. Let me see if I can. I'll zoom out just a little bit so you guys can see everything. Um, comes with a standard windshield wiper type. And then you get a twisted. Um, it comes with this, uh, like a round bar. You could probably use this either top of the keyway or <clears throat> bottom of the keyway. Um, and then it comes with two pry bars. Looks like it's. It won't be too bad. Looks like there's a 40 and a 50 thousandths for those. Some more tension wrenches. Um, in this set, there's probably only a few of these picks that I would use. Actually, all the actual picks I would probably use. You get a, a nice DeForest Diamond type pick um, in 15th, 15,000th, or 15 thousandths, and then you get it also in uh, 23 thousandths. So you can see here, both of those. Um, the mirror, let me see, they almost look like the Peterson, a little less, uh, uh, Peterson's a little bit sharper here on the end, they've rounded this off a little bit, but you can see profiles a little thinner on the Peterson one. Um, and they have a couple different hooks here, you can see the differences in these hooks are, uh, difference in the hooks. One of them's kind of pointy on the end, the other one's rounded off. So those are the, probably the three main picks. It comes with a diamond also. Um, and then three different types of or three or let's see one, two, four, four rakes. Triple peak or the Bogota, a little L rake or city rake. Um, then it comes with an S type rake. That one probably needs filed off a little bit. That's got a little sharp edge on it. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know if I'll use any of these rakes. Um, but you can see they come in, these are the 15 thousandths and these are the 23 thousandths. So you get two different, you get two different um, thicknesses, which is pretty cool. Uh, that's one thing that a lot of these, these, these pick sets are missing are the, uh, the double thicknesses. Um, I haven't decided on if I'm going to put the put handle or put put covers on the handles. Um, 
I kind of like to leave them as is a lot of times when I get these when I get these picks. But um, I'm definitely going to use them to pick. Uh, so I, you know what? I'm going to try. Let's see, let's see if I can do it right now. I'm going to try to pick a lock real quick with this. Let's see what we can do. Let's throw all these off to the side. and 23 thousandths. Uh, let's see what we got here. Got a challenge lock here, Bronx Lock Picker 60. Uh, this will be my first challenge lock by him. Let's see if we can get it open with this Praxis kit, something out of this Praxis kit. Uh, here, we'll just use this tension wrench. This bottom of the keyway. I haven't picked the bottom of the keyway in a long time, so it should be interesting. from Peterson. No, man, whatever. Let's see if we can get this thing open. Don't worry about my dirty desk. Sorry about it, guys. Let's see if we can get this lock picked with this uh, Praxis kit. You guys see it all the time on Bosnia Bill, so my review doesn't really mean much. I was just happy to get it in. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, back of the lock. Do a little turn on the core. Click out of three. Click out of two. A little click and turn out of one. Got a four. I'm trying to get at the right angle on this thing. Oh, just dropped it all. Yeah, it's okay. Let's see if we can start again. There we go. Make sure my head's not in the way. Put it. Get it back here in the back of the lock. Click out of five. A little counter on three with a click. Count on one with a click. Three with another click. Two with a click. One with another click. Okay, four with a click. Yeah, we're stuck on two. Okay, some counter off at two. Didn't give me a click, but it did take away some of that false set. Definitely a different feeling. Uh, Doing bottom of the keyway. I haven't done bottom of the keyway in a while. All right, got a little bit more false set back. Feels like three wants to open us up. Maybe. There's a click, and there we go. All right, we're open. In fact, we're open on three. So um, you can see this Praxis kit. That was the Praxis uh, twenty-three thousandths. Um, the Dangerfield Praxis. I got it off of uh, UK Bump Keys. Um, just a little bottom of the keyway tension wrench. Let's, uh, let's get this lock gutted open. And then uh, I can sign off. I appreciate you guys being with me. Uh, it's going to be a long week for sure next week. Dealing with a funeral, and, but you know, I'll uh, we'll make it through. We'll make it through. All right. Let's see. Yep, I'm in frame. You guys can see. 
I don't have a key for this, so we don't want to lock it back up. These are facing me. Or through. See everything needed picked. Come on, camera, work for me. Um, looks like number three is going to be threaded. Let's see what else we got in here. Two and four are threaded. One's a nice little sharp spool. Every one of the springs are down below the shear lines. If I can get these things out, Okay, it's got a little. Uh, let's see what the top's got going on. He's got some tape on it, so I assume he's done some work up there. Uh, looks like just number one's got some threading in it. Go ahead and zoom in so you guys can see the work that Bronk Lock Picker 60's done on these pins. So you guys can see, there's chamber one. Nice little, I'd call it almost like a spool. Little serrated key pin, serrated key pin in two with another serrated uh, driver. Uh, little spools, and then a uh, kind of a spool and spool driver in three. Um, real nice work on these pins, and then a uh, serrated spool. With another, there's a little serration in the middle of that spool too. So another serrated spool, um, serrated driver or serrated key pin in five, and another serrated spool, um, 
It's a really long one in uh, five. Um, good mixture of springs, one copper and two. Everything else looks like they're steel. All right, guys. So, uh, excellent work, Bronclock Picker 60. I appreciate you sending that out to the community. Um, and then, you know, this is the Praxis kit. If you guys are looking for some thinner picks, especially um, some actual usable, there's at least six picks for single pen picking in here that you would get some use out of. You got some 23 thousandths and some 15 thousandths. So uh, if you guys are looking for a set of picks that are a little bit thinner, um, you know, this may be the way to go. Um, I'll let you know as soon as I uh, start picking some some of these other locks that need a little bit thinner picks or I, mean, I don't have anything to get around the keyways in. So for now, um, I'm going to be signing off for a little bit and uh, hopefully in a week or so I'll be back and uh, you know have some more challenge locks um, picked out on camera. But I uh, appreciate the support of the community. Thanks for everything you guys do and uh, I'll be on to the next lock. Thanks guys. Thank <laughs> you.